Hey guys, welcome back to Tanks Gaming with another Armored Warfare video. You see it's still holiday Christmas spirit uh, theme with, uh, with uh, lights on the wall, the Christmas tree, the ribbon on the tank, the, uh, on the armored vehicle, armored cheap I guess, uh, ribbon on the tank turret and some presents in the shelf. Anyway guys, I thought today I show off the obje Object 430. I probably won't make uh, show off the OF40 because it's actually nearly the same as the OF the ordinary OF40 is except for the ammunition choices, I guess. Let me check. Uh yeah, it has a little less powerful ammunition than the fully upgraded OF-40. Which actually is fully upgraded, right? Mm, yep, it is. Except for... For the... The... Battle Hardened, which will cost me real gold. And the... Credit Pack which I actually could do with free experience together. I'm not gonna do that. So, but I don't think I have anything similar than the <coughs> to the Object 430. Uh, I don't think I have. Um, so I'm going to showcase the, o, uh, the Object 430 in this video. I for sure will do one of the T72 and also of the Leo 2AV ice versions, of course. Uh, and I'll probably then go on and level up starships. So after the starships, uh, a st starship, I will get, <laughs> I will get the M60A3, which I just showcased uh, the ice version of it. So I don't know. Maybe I should go into the BMP and the uh, the BMP development or the recon vehicles as well as the wheel to destroyers. I don't think I have done quite a lot in Shishkins. Nah, I haven't. I probably should go with uh, by T62 as well. I have the veteran version of that, but it doesn't uh, do anything to actually unlock the T64. Uh, as well as the high caliber light armor and tactical artillery, as well as fire support to vehicles. And I would really love to get into the Chieftain, the Challenger, and the Ariat. Anyway guys, I'm going to pick the OF Object 430 and first I'm going to do a PvE mission to check it out, get a little bit, get the, hand, get the handling to know a little bit and then as well I will level up my remaining tank driver. She's more for uh, tank commander, she's more for, uh, for recon vehicles, but anyway I'm gonna do that. <coughs> So I'm going to level up the crew uh, because it's a premium vehicle from a package. You get a fully trained crew on it and bring it back as soon as I'm loaded into a PvE battle, guys. So I'll be right back. And I'm back, guys. Um, this is actually this mission is actually called quarterback or quarterback, quarterback. I guess it's from the American football term. The guy who gets the ball and does the that's the place, so either he does he plays a pass play or um, a running a running play, it's mostly his decision. So there we have one. Uh, fired hit. We didn't got the kill, but he is not feeling so hot anymore. Mm, can't see him, can't see him. 300 damage. And yep, blew up. Blew up nicely. 301 damage. I probably should shoot at the chieftain. Yep. Their lower plate is penetrable and we get our first kill finally. So the firepower of this vehicle is okay but not the best I would say. That was just a track damage. And Come on, 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 come on. Oh, <laughs> just demobilized him because I blew off his tracks. I probably should switch my ammunition from heat to something else. 
I'm going to do that for the next shot, actually, guys. Uh, oh. I pressed it twice, so he's loading now. That's not good. Don't like that. 219. 271, I mean. And out he is. Okay. Uh, I think that could be my kill. Not quite sure if I did it or somebody else did it, but at least we blew him up, right? So the speed of it, of the object for, uh, what is it, 480 is quite good. I like it. I have to say he, he, the speed is okay. And, well, damage wise, after. Well, it was a bigger tank, it had a bigger gun, but I liked the M60 more. A little bit more, at least. Oops, he blew up. Luckily, I didn't shoot. There is an enemy tank. Zoom in, my friend. Zoom in. No penetration. Okay. There is a green. I should penetrate him there. No penetration. Okay, switching back to heat ammunition. And Whoop, he disappeared. So that was a miss. So backwards, he's not that fast. Good work. That, down that actually went through and destroyed him. Very nice. <coughs> so I think the Type 59 Legends are still faster than me. But I think I should do well here. Because, well, for one, um, the t Type 59 is actually taking the heat. Even though this one switched his priority target to me, probably. Ouch! Okay, we have new enemy spawn out here. They really just spawned, or we were just blind? So I actually hit his ammo rack, that's pr pretty good. Mm. Can I get through his turret? Right, company, yes. I can get through his command, your Copiola. Should turn my oh, tank. Sorry. I want to destroy the chief oh, first. Down. I did blow up the chief. So he bounces, which is good. Meaning my armor should be strong enough against those guys. But the first shot from this guy behind this this guy back there I guess was it he actually did quite some damage to me okay turn your turret load it and he was close enough so I didn't have to aim fully the fully in I guess I should turn up here now to actually help our two ah, still just two 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 t 59s legends yeah and it was a bad decision because there are already enemies coming from the other side again. And one from back here. Yep, very nice penetration. Load, 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 load. I actually don't want to win by capping. I would rather get another kill in so I drive out of the cap circle. Which might give me the chance to at least get one more shot off. Come on. Don't cap, guys. We can win this by annihilation. There he is. Ah, man. He got saved by... Oh, man. What kind of gun has he on? Scorpion? He does actually do some damage to me. Not quite a lot, but he does damage. Oops. Probably should have zoomed in. I go for the lower glazes one more time, which should finish him off. It did finish him off. Okay. Then I didn't pay attention if that did actually any damage to me, um, which would be kind of bad, but still, that's it. We won the PVE mission, and I would say that was quite easy. Okay, it was just medium difficulty. But that's also due to the fact that I couldn't go on high difficulty because it's just a tier 3 vehicle. 
So, I'm going to bring you guys back as soon as I'm loaded into a PvE match. Hey guys, and I'm back on a PvP battle on the Lost Island map, or on the Lost Island. Um, actually, quite a lot of people are driving the Type 59 Legend, the Christmas New Year present from Obsidian and MyGame.com or My.com. <coughs> I got one in my garage as well, and I think I did a showcase of it. Anyway, um, I actually don't really like this map. Uh, I have it played. I played it about four or five times. Um, somewhere wins, somewhere loses, but I haven't found a good spot to play on this map with my metal tanks or with my uh, anti-tank, the T61, the Typhoon, as well. Ugh, he is coming around the corner, isn't he? Yes, he is. Oh, man. But there was a little bump, so I couldn't shoot him. But I can shoot him. Now. So I have wasn't over-penetrating, meaning uh, the choice of ammunition is actually okay for him. And I know I should probably know that before I shoot at somebody, but for that I just don't play this game enough. And I haven't figured out which is the right ammo combination for which tank. He actually sees me. It's a Type 59 Legend. Uh, there is a broken down airplane in the way. Where was he? There he is. There is actually a spot I can penetrate him. Yep, I got through. I did about 200 damage to him. Uh, he's now pointing... Oh boy! I need to get out of here. He actually does more than enough damage to me. I can't do nearly as much to him as he does to me. Okay, ouch. So I'm down to 13 hit points, guys. And that was from three hits from Type 59s. So I would say I'm in a little bit of trouble. And the Type 59 actually has more hit points. And I wouldn't say he has the better armor. Or I can't say he has the better armor because I can't really compare that to each other. Where am I spotted from down there? But to that I actually can get through. What is it? A pattern 48. Ah oh man. Now he drove into a dip so I can't see him anymore. I was thinking there might be one but there isn't. I don't really want to drive much further out because then I probably get hit by T-59s again. And I'm spotted. Don't, not quite sure by whom. Ah, oh, by him. And I get a hit in with T-62. Okay. With still armor penetrating ammunition. I probably sh should switch to heat on this distance. No, I got him. I did actually good for my team in a PvE mission, a PvP mission. Very nice. I don't do normally do that. Normally I'm a liability and one of the first guys dead on the team just because I play it probably a little bit wrong over here. So I'm not spotted at the moment, so if I drive out here... Ooh, I knew there is a Tag 59 somewhere. It's a T-62. Actually, can't spot him, but I can't actually aim at him. Ah, oh, there he is. Oh! Okay, Type 59 Legend was. Uh, that was him. Damn it. Okay. He blew me up nicely. So, anyway, guys, uh, the Type. Uh, the Object 430 is a good tank. Uh, I like it. For PvE, it's definitely a good choice. For PvP, I had better games in PvP with other tanks. Um, I will test it out a little bit more and I might even get a very decent PvP game in it. But it's not really my cup of tea, I would say. <coughs> I like the bulkier, bigger tanks which has a little bit more which have a little bit more hit points and can can take a little more uh, hits actually. So anyway guys, that's it for this video. Uh, I hope you liked this video. If you did, please hit the like button. You can also subscribe to my channel for more daily videos. And uh, you, if you want, you can also follow me on Twitter or on Facebook. 
So one more time, thanks for watching guys, and I hope I see you in my next video. Bye!